Okay. Hey there, welcome to our crown chakra class. I'm so excited to lead you guys through this flow today. It's gonna be really great to help us feel more connected to ourselves and the world around us. So let's go ahead and just dive right in, starting at the back of our mat, bending our knees as we inhale, lift up, exhale, float our fingertips down, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, forward fold, bending the knees as we inhale, lift up, exhale, coming down, Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Bending the knees as we inhale, everything comes up to the sky. And exhale, fingertips come down. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, coming back down. And we're going to walk our hands towards the front of our mats. Lowering our knees to the ground, lowering our heart to the earth. Inhale as we lift up for cobra. Exhale, come back through child's pose. Taking a breath here for one, two, three. Coming back up into tabletop position, tuck your toes as we push back, downward facing dog. Inhale, come forward through plank. Lower your knees to the ground, bending our elbows, heart comes to the earth. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, back through child's pose. Breathing here for five. Four, three, two, one. Coming back up through tabletop position. Tucking our toes as we lift back down our facing dog. Inhale, come forward through plank. Lower our knees. Heart comes down to the earth. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, back through child's pose for three, two, one. Inhale, back up through tabletop, tucking our toes as we push back, downward facing dog. And we'll slowly walk our feet up to our hands. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, bending the knees as we lift up, everything comes up. And exhale, everything comes down. Going to stay here in Tadasana for a minute, mountain pose. So our feet are shoulder width distance apart. We're pressing the four corners of our feet into our mat. Lengthening our spine, opening our heart, allowing our shoulders to sink down to the earth. And we'll focus on our breath here. So you might have noticed already, I'm not playing any music. The crown chakra is very stimulated by silence. So I'm going to do my best to keep quiet during this flow and I encourage you to, you know, life isn't perfect. There's going to be some background noise, but I encourage you to focus on contemplating what the sound of silence experiences through you. how your body experiences the silence. Thinking about how when we go out deep into space, there's just nothingness, empty bliss. I'm wondering if we can channel that in our lives, in our bodies, in our mind. 
to help us feel more connected to the world around us as the planets are rotating around the sun we exist with purpose and with love taking a few more breaths here And everyone, let's bend our knees as we inhale, lift up, exhale, come down, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, walking our hands out into plank, lowering our knees, our chest, our chin, inhaling as we press up, exhale, coming back, tucking our toes down, we're facing dog. Right leg lifts up to the sky, taking a few nice big hip circles, one direction. Mm, let's go the opposite direction. Mm, we'll lift our right leg up to the sky. And come forward, placing the sole of our foot in between our hands as we inhale, lift up. I lunge. Exhale, spiraling the left foot back, 45 degrees, warrior one. Standing straight, bending deeply into the right leg. Fingers reach up to the sky. And exhale, coming forward into pyramid, allowing your head to reach towards the earth. On your next inhale, bending into the front leg, lift up, warrior one. And exhale, come back down, pyramid. On your next inhale, bend into the front leg, come back up, warrior one. And exhale, one more time, come down, pyramid. On your next inhale, pressing into the front leg, we're going to step up, Utkatasana, chair pose. And exhale, bring your hands to prayer, twisting to the right side. Inhale, lift everything up. And exhale, prayer pose back down to the right side. Inhale, lift everything up, chair pose. One more time, hands come to prayer as we step our left leg back up into warrior one. And exhale, coming forward, pyramid. Inhale, lift everything up, coming back, chair pose. Inhale, everything comes up. Exhale, Tadasana. 
Inhale, in, everything comes up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, walk your hands to the front of your mat. Coming through plank, lower your knees, lower your chest, lower your chin. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, come back through child's pose, tucking your toes, downward facing dog. Left leg comes up to the sky, rotating our leg one way. And we'll go the opposite direction. Recentering our leg as we inhale, lift up. Exhale, bringing our knee in towards our chest, planting our foot on the ground as we come up, high lunge. Spiraling our right foot out 45 degrees. Warrior one. Exhale, coming forward, straightening through the front leg. Pyramid posture. On your next inhale, bending into the front leg, lift up, warrior one. Exhale, coming down, pyramid. Inhale, bending into the front leg, lift all the way up. Exhale, coming forward, pyramid posture. On your next inhale, bending into the left knee as we bring our right leg up. Inhale, Utkatasana. Exhale, hands come through prayer over to the left side. Inhale, everything back up. Utkatasana. Squeezing those glutes, you got this. Exhale, hands come through prayer, twisting to the left. Big deep breaths here. Together we'll inhale to rise. Exhale, Utkatasana. On your next inhale, lift up, right leg comes up and back, warrior one. Maybe taking a slight back bend. And exhale, coming down, pyramid posture. Crown touches the earth. Pressing our hands into the ground as we lift our left leg back up to the sky. Coming forward into plank, lower knees, chest, chin, touch the earth. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, coming back through child's pose. Taking a few breaths here. Feeling ourselves, feeling our body. Inhale as we come back up through tabletop, 
taking cow and cat. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Inhale, bend the elbows, look up. Exhale, rounding the spine, arching our back. One more time, we'll inhale, bend the elbows, look up. And exhale, pressing into the palms, into the tops of our feet, letting everything go. And when you're ready, we'll tuck our toes, come back into downward facing dog. We can walk our hands up to our feet, hanging out in a forward fold, feeling the four corners of each foot firmly on our mats. Reaching our crown towards the earth. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold, bending up the knees as we inhale, lift everything up. Exhale, Tadasana, mountain pose. Noticing if this feels any different from our first mountain pose. Visualizing vast expansive space, reaching through the corners of our mind. Together we'll bend our knees as we inhale, lift up, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold, walking our hands back towards the front of our mat into plank, lowering knees, chest, chin, inhale, lift up, exhale, tuck our toes as we push back, downward facing dog, inhale, right leg lifts up, exhale, knee to chest, planting our foot on the ground, inhale, lift up, warrior one, Exhale, come forward, pyramid. Inhale, lift up, Utkatasana. Exhale, coming down, twisting. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, everything comes down. Step back into plank, lower knees, chest, chin. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, coming back, tucking our toes, downward facing dog. Left leg lifts up to the sky. Inhale, knee to chest, planting our feet on the ground as we lift up, warrior one. Exhale, come forward, pyramid posture. Inhale, lift up, Utkatasana. Exhale, hands come down through prayer, twisting to the left side. Inhale, everything comes up. Exhale, hands to earth, stepping back. Lower knees, chest, chin. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, tucking our toes, downward facing dog. Holding here for five. Holding for four. Holding for three. Holding for two. Holding for one. Awesome. Right leg comes up to the sky. Knee to chest. Lift up, warrior one. Exhale, come forward, pyramid posture. Inhale, step forward, Utkatasana. Exhale, hands come through prayer, twisting to the right. Now this time we're going to inhale as we lift our right leg. We're going to hop back. So everyone can see me lifting our right leg. 
And exhale, we can bring our foot to our thigh. You can place it on your calf or on your ankle, wherever you are. Finding tree. Focusing on a still spot in front of you. And when you feel grounded and stable, inhale, hands rise. If you fall, that's wonderful. It's just yoga. Get right back into it. It's part of the practice. And when you exhale, we can bring our hands back down. Our right arm is coming underneath our left arm as we take eagle arms and yes you guessed it right leg comes up can twist over our left thigh maybe taking a double bind inhale as you lift up exhale sinking deep pressing our thighs together our elbows are coming forward and up stretching behind our heart Thinking a little bit deeper, breathing here, in through the nose, out through the nose. And slowly untwist your arms. Slowly untwist your legs, inhale, everything comes back up, coming back through tree posture. Maybe our hands are at prayer now. Lovely, lower hands, taking our right leg, big step forward, inhale, warrior one, right leg is forward, exhale, straightening our front leg as we come down, pyramid posture. Inhale, straighten the spine, exhale, sink a little bit deeper. Inhale, straighten the spine. Exhale, left hip comes forward a little bit more. Now your crown to reach towards the earth. Inhale as we press into our palms, stepping back into plank. Lowering knees, chest, chin, or chaturanga dandasana. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, coming back, downward facing dog. Big breath here. Now left leg lifts up to the sky. Inhale, knee to chest, planting our foot as we come up, warrior one. Inhale, exhale, pyramid posture. Inhale, lift up, Utkatasana, chair pose. Exhale, hands come down through prayer to the left side. Inhale, everything comes up, step back again. Exhale, finding our center, bringing our left sole of our foot to our right leg. As we inhale, everything comes up. 
And exhale, continuing to breathe in through the nose and out through the nose. Sometimes the silence is a little scary, a little intimidating, but stay with those feelings. Just stay with whatever comes up, accept, feel them. Feel the feelings, they want to be felt. Awesome job, guys. This time, hands come down, left arm comes under right, eagle arms on the opposite side, elbows come forward and up, taking our left leg, crossing over our right thigh, sinking deep into that right leg, squeezing our thighs together, squeezing, really using the resistance as balance. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, release your eagle grip, open the heart. As you inhale, lift everything back up. Exhale, back through tree posture. Hands come to heart this time, breathing. Inhale, exhale. Beautiful, release your prayer. Inhale, big step forward with the left foot, spiraling the right foot, comes to a 45 degree angle as we bend into the front knee, lift up, warrior one. Exhale, pyramid posture, crown reaches towards the earth. Inhale, palms come to your mat as you lengthen the spine. Exhale, sink a little bit deeper, right hip comes forward. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, release. And on your next inhale, pushing into our palms as we step back through plank. Lowering knees, chest, chin, or chaturanga dandasana. Inhale, up. Exhale, back, child's pose. Beautiful, now together we'll inhale as we slowly walk our fingers. Shifting our weight over to the right side as our feet come out in front of us. Take staff pose, inhale, heart opens. Exhale, pushing through our legs as if there's a wall right in front of us.
awesome job. Now let's bring our left foot in, kind of like tree pose, but seated. And we're going to inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, bring everything forward. Each breath, lengthening your spine. And every exhale, sinking a little bit deeper. So we're moving with our breath. On your next inhale, lift up ever so slightly. We'll take our left hand, wherever it is, on your knee, on your calf, on your foot. And our right arm is going to lift up. So we're taking just like a nice little twist here. Doesn't have to look pretty. Just getting a nice stretch in our back, opening the backs of our hearts, opening the backs of our legs. Breathing as we inhale, lengthening the spine. Exhale, revolving a little bit more. Exhale, coming back down. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, release forward again. On your next inhale, tiptoe, tiptoe your fingers back up to center. And we'll take our left leg and cross it over to the outside of our right thighs. We inhale, open the heart. Exhale, nice gentle twist here. Breathing as we inhale, lengthen and exhale. Twisting a little bit deeper. So on your next inhale, slowly come back through center, switching the cross of our legs, so our left foot is out in front of us, and our right sole of our foot is towards our inner left thigh. Inhale, lift up, and exhale, coming forward, any amount, whatever is comfortable for you in this present moment.
Inhale, lift up halfway. Exhale, taking a twist, left arm comes back. And on your next inhale, come back towards center. Exhale, come forward again. Any amount is totally perfect. On your next inhale, slowly bring yourself back up to a seated position, taking our right leg and crossing it to the outside of our left thigh. Inhale, heart opens. Exhale, taking a nice twist in the opposite direction. Inhale, exhale. And on your next inhale, releasing the twist. Bringing our feet, soles of our feet to touch and butterfly. We'll inhale, our heart opens. Exhale, coming forward, any amount. On your next inhale, walk your fingertips back into your body. And we're going to come onto our knees. Take rabbit's pose. So, coming forward, bringing the crown of our head to our mat and clasping our fingers, just lifting up. Any amount.
And I encourage you, let's bring our hands back down to our mat. I encourage you to play with this. Don't get so serious, but just press into the soles of our feet, our hands, our on our mats. If you want to look at me for a minute, go ahead. Keeping the crown of our head like firmly, firmly placed into the ground. We're going to push, push, push into our hands and place our knees on our triceps. So we're just coming into a little tripod headstand. You can totally just play with this here or you don't even have to lift up. You can totally just like, you know, hang out with your feet on the ground. But wherever you are, bring your feet back down if you are up. And we'll come back into a child's pose with our hands behind us. Focusing on the inhale and exhale. Feeling safe in our body. Feeling safe in our mind. Relaxing, releasing into our mats. And together, let's inhale, crawl ourselves forward to straighten out and flip around. So we're laying on our backs, soles of our feet touch, we're on butterfly, reclined, supta baddha konasana. You can place your hands on your belly like mine are, or you can place them on your hips, your thighs, you can have them out to the side with your palms up to receive. Wherever you are, just relax. Feeling calm, feeling centered, feeling balanced. And if you want to stay here, you're more than welcome to. Or lengthening our legs out for Shavasana. And if your legs are lengthened out for Shavasana, tuck our shoulder blades underneath. Opening our heart, letting go.
Slowly begin wiggling your fingers. Slowly begin deepening your breath. Wiggling your fingertips and your toes. Rotating your wrists and your ankles as you take a nice big stretch overhead. And let's come on over to the right side of our bodies. Taking a moment here. Reflecting. And without opening our eyes, let's use our hands to press us back up to a nice seated position. We can sit like this. You can sit up on a pillow or block if that's comfortable. Um, you can also sit in lotus with one ankle over the thigh or calf lotus or full lotus with both your ankles up. Um, we're just going to do a nice short meditation. So fingertip, uh, index finger and thumbs touch to Gyan Mudra, which stimulates wisdom, inner knowing. And we'll inhale, lengthening the spine. Exhale, feeling grounded into the roots of the earth. And we'll inhale, opening our heart. Exhale, relaxing our shoulder blades down, down, down our back. And we'll begin noticing the breath as it enters our nostrils, feeling the quality of the air as it enters our body. Noticing the invigorating prana circulating through our systems. Trusting our spirituality, our wisdom that has guided us this far. Feeling connected to the world around us. Knowing in our heart we have a true purpose to fulfill in our lifetimes and this true purpose our world would be incomplete without it Start deepening your breath and remember that we can always connect with our spirituality, with the divine through our breath. It is the power of the prana that exists around us that gives us life, gives us energy, sustains us. Visualize this life coming through the crown of your head as a bright, vibrant light. 
And slowly start awakening out of your meditation. Bringing your hands to prayer. The light in me honors the light in you. I'm so, so grateful for you taking the time to practice with me today. Sending lots and lots of love your way. Mm -hmm. Namaste.